Your Excellency, President of the Republic of China, Taiwan, Tai Ing-wen, Cabinet colleagues, Resident Ambassador of the Republic of China, Taiwan, to St. Kitts and Nevis, Your Excellency Tom Lee, Resident Ambassador of St. Kitts and Nevis to the Republic of China, Taiwan, Your Excellency Jasmine Huggins, Excellencies of the Diplomatic and Consular Corps, Dr. the Right Honorable Sir Kennedy Simmons, our first national hero, sorry, our national hero and Lady Simmons, special guests, well wishers, ladies and gentlemen all. 蔡总统阁下、各位内阁成员、李大使、哈金斯大使、史杰团成员以及圣克里斯多福吉尼维斯的国家英雄、席蒙斯爵士抗力、各国的贵国的访团成员、各位贵宾、各位女士先生、晚
that led that effort into independence and, as it were, formalized the establishment of diplomatic relations with the Republic of China. I speak to Dr. Sir Kennedy Alphonse Simmons, who is here. Sir Kennedy, could you stand and receive a warm hand of welcome? 在此，我仅代表圣克政府及其人民表达我们对总统阁下的访问深感荣幸。这一趟来访是要庆祝我们三十六年的邦谊。那今天晚上，我也非常荣幸可以说，我们在三十六年前当初呃独立。出独立的时候，并且也正式与中华民国台湾签下呃正式的邦交关系的呃的人，就是今天我们的国家英雄席蒙斯爵士，他今晚也在场，让我们热烈的以鼓呃鼓掌欢迎他。I again thank Sir Kennedy and the other members of his cabinet who were responsible for that signal movement. By Saint Kitts and Nevis, and let me, in this regard, too, recognise here, dining with us or to dine with us, Her Excellency Dame Constance Mitchum. Could you stand and could we also give her a special hand of welcome? I recognise also with us His Excellency Michael Oliver Powell, who was part of the government then way back in 1983. That made the determination on this development. Could we give <laughs> Ambassador Powell a hand of welcome? The honour of your visit, Madam President, is even more exhilarating, considering that this is only the third time that our Federation has had the privilege of hosting a president. From the Republic of China, the first time was way back in 2005, when President Chen Shui-bian made an official state visit to Saint Kitts and Nevis, and the second occasion was in 2013, when President Ma visited Saint Kitts and Nevis. 今晚除了我们的国家英雄席蒙斯爵士之外，其实在场也有许也有另外两位圣克的政府官员，他们也是促成了台克邦营的正式成立。那今天晚上呢，我们能够接待蔡总统，我们也感到更具有意义、更荣幸的是，因为这是圣克第三次有荣幸接待中华民国台湾总统。第一次是二零零五年陈前总统的国事访问，第二次是马前总统于二零一三年的访问。Tonight, six years after the last presidential visit to Saint Kitts and Nevis, the stars above us seem to be in perfect alignment, auguring well for the closer connection between our two countries in the years to come. As I reflect on the vast beauty and hope that fill tonight's sky, and on the huge significance. Significance of President Tsai's first official state visit to the Federation. I am reminded of the proverb that says, "A journey of a thousand miles begins with a single step." 距离上一次的元首访问六年之后，我们能够再次相聚，我认为也预示了两国未来关系必加更紧密。这是蔡总统第一次来访圣克里斯多夫。那今晚的星空和美充满希望，也让我想起一句谚语：“千里之行，始于足下。” It has been my singular honor and pleasure to have journeyed several times to the Republic of China, Taiwan. Most recently in April this year, when Your Excellency invested me with the Order of Propitious Clouds. With special grand cordon, one of Taiwan's highest orders and decorations conferred on a foreign head of government. I and members of my administration have learned a lot and gained a keen appreciation of the Republic of China's values, culture, and identity by visiting your country. 
These official visits over the past several years have enabled us to take a step in the right direction for the mutual benefit of our countries and our people. 我非常荣幸能够有机会多次访问台湾。最近一次是今年四月获得总统阁下亲自颁赠的特种大寿青云勋章，是台湾政府颁给国外元首的最高荣誉。我与我政府团队透过访问贵国学到了很多，也更深入地了解了台湾的价值以及文化。过去这些年的交流，让我们能够。把两国关系发展朝向对的方向前进，为彼此的人民增进福祉。Your Excellency, Madam President, I am very happy then that you have traveled these many miles to witness and experience the culture and the way of life of the people of the beautiful Federation of Saint Kitts and Nevis. I hope that you and your delegation. Will find our hospitality to be as exceptional and memorable as the excellent arrangements that your government provides us whenever we visit the Republic of China, Taiwan. And I also trust that the authenticity and charm of our people will leave an enduring impression on you and your esteemed delegation. 因此，我非常高兴蔡总统今天不远千里而来，亲自体验盛客的美。希望我们的接待能够让阁下及访团印象深刻，就像我们每一次访问台湾时所受到的热情款待一样印象深刻。我相信盛客人民的真诚和魅力也会让阁下以及访团难忘。Your Excellency, as a token of our high esteem for you and for the government of the Republic of China, Taiwan. We are delighted to confer a new tomorrow at Government House, the Order of Saint Christopher and Nevis, a very special decoration set out in the National Honours Amendment Act of 2005, which has been conferred on your predecessors, Presidents Chen and Ma. The Order of Saint Christopher and Nevis is the highest award. That can be bestowed to a non-national of Saint Christopher and Nevis. Could we give Madam President a round of applause in the seat of this honour? 为了表达圣克里斯多夫对阁下以及中华民国台湾的敬意，我们明天将颁赠总统阁下圣克里斯多夫及尼维斯勋章。这是我国国家荣誉法当中所规定的勋章，马前总统及陈前总统都曾接受过。那这也是圣克赠予外国人的最高荣誉。I want finally to commend the astute and outstanding leadership of President Tsai. The first elected female to the office of presidency of the Republic of China, Taiwan. Give her another round of applause. 最后，我也要再次赞赏蔡总统所展现出来的领导能力，是中华民国台湾的第一任女性总统。Her firm and competent leadership has been an example to all, and Taiwan has grown in strength and stature. Internationally, as a result of the quality of diplomacy being pursued by her and her government, again she deserves a round of applause of one of the most powerful leaders in the world. 那么，因为有蔡总统坚定的领导，我想为全世界。展现出一个典范，也因为有蔡总统的这成功的外交政策，让台湾越来越能够有能见度。我想，我们能不能再一次掌声鼓励，赞赏一下蔡总统所展现出来的领导能力 ？As I did in our bilateral talks preceding this meeting, I wish to assure all that Saint Kitts and Nevis will remain steadfast. In his advocacy on behalf of the Republic of China and Taiwan, the Republic of China and Taiwan has been an excellent friend, a reliable friend, and on Saint Kitts and Nevis, it can count on always to advocate 
in a most robust and consistent way for it to play a full role as a member of the international community. We look forward then to host Madam President, you and your delegation over the next several days or couple of days for which you're here. And I want to ask those with glasses to raise them in tribute to your visit, in commendation of your journey. And we say thank you for starting this journey of a thousand miles between our two countries. And we hope that this journey will last forever, will be exciting and fulfilling. And of course, we hope that our journey of cooperation will never end. To the President of the Republic of China, cheers. 就像我在双边谈到的呢，盛客会持续的支持台湾的国际参与，我也非常期待接下来几天接待总统阁下，也感谢总统跨出了这一步来到盛客，开启了两国邦谊千里之行的新篇章，敬祝贵我两国的邦